she's going to get Ted to drop this whole thing or going to she's going to pay him off or she's going to throw him out a window or hop back in bed with him. Okay, look, I, I have an idea. Just put me on this. Let me see what I can find out. Maybe I'll figure out what happened to Leo's body or I, I can dig up dirt on Ted that we can use against him. Okay, I, as much as I love the idea of being proactive, I honestly, I don't think we should do anything until we hear from Kate first. I agree. I mean, if we're lucky, it'll end with Kate. Yeah. Although luck hasn't exactly been on our side. Well, you guys have me now, and I'm here and ready and willing to do whatever I can to help. I know. I, and I'm, I'm lucky you're even talking to me. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Paul, for getting you into this nightmare. Hey, we will get through this together. I love you. Remember? Yeah. Even though I, I, I gave you every reason to tell me. Paul, you're amazing. <laughs> I just, I just feel, I just feel bad that I was so wrong about you and Sonny. I'm glad I was. So, <laughs> when is the big day? Have you set a date yet? I say the sooner the better. Mm -hmm. You know, John and Marlena's wedding is right around the corner. So, Jennifer. When Marlena tosses that bouquet, I want you to get right in the front of the line. And if Eve Donovan tries to, to shove you aside, you have my permission to just shove her back. <laughs> or better yet, I'll trip her. <laughs> darling, 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 let's, let's see if this town can get through one wedding without fireworks. Well, I really don't think that Brady should rush into marriage to this woman. After all, her sister broke his heart, and I'm sure he is still on the rebound from Nicole. Oh. I'm sorry. Very sorry. No, it's it's fine. It is. Really. Jennifer knows that I'm completely over Nicole. And I love her. And only her. And on that happiest note... Julie and I have to get back to the club. Oh, right. Well, thank you both for celebrating with us. Absolutely. <laughs> Eric, I might have been an advocate for you and Nicole once. But man, now that you found Jennifer, I believe that is a perfect match. Really, I'm so glad that you waited. To, to, you're absolutely sure that she's the right lady. Yeah, I've never been more sure about anything in my life. Doug was upset with me for mentioning Nicole. But I'm glad I brought her up. It's obvious that Eric has put her in the past where she belongs. And you, I haven't seen you this happy since Jack. Oh, darling. You deserve a good man because you are the kindest, most selfless, most loving soul Julia, I, know. I know about that. I know about it. You and Eric have been through such loss, such tragedy, and now you found happiness again with each other. 